how do you determine how good someone is at something? In real life, we have standardized testing where we compare our results with our peers. And in Hypixel Skyblock, it's no different. We have something called weight. Weight is a system where it takes into account all sorts of stats on your profile like your skills, catacombs level, slayer XP, etc. And with that number, you can easily determine what stage of the game someone is in. You can easily tell how much they have grinded and how experienced they are. But that wasn't the case for the longest time in Hypixel Skyblock. During the earlier stages of Skyblock, there isn't really a standard for endgame. Sure, there's the pigment sword, the emerald armor, but that's about it. The first quote unquote standard for an endgame player appeared after the release of the end update. You would need a full set of superior dragon armor, an AOTD, or a pigment sword to be considered as endgame. But this won't be the standard for long, since guilds like first place frags would add a 50 million coin my destroy requirement, pushing the endgame standard further and further. And first place frags will later add a skill average and slayer join requirement, giving us a good idea of what an endgame player looks like. And with endgame players joining guilds like First Place Frags, Trouble Brewing, Flexing Chimps, there grew a rivalry between those guilds. And people are curious what guild is on top. So a player named Garth Sidious made a forum post called Hypixel Skyblock Guilds ranked by Average Slayer EXP and Average Skill XP. It was the leaderboard of top guilds ranked by a number that is calculated based off of the guild's skill average and slayer XP. It was nothing special, but it was the first form of weight that we have but there was still no standardized way of calculating individual players. Sure, we have skill average and slayer XP to tell how good the player is, but what if someone has a high skill average but very low slayer XP, or vice versa? There wasn't really a good way to differentiate between players, and we needed some sort of standardized system. On July 26, 2020, the first standardized system was made accessible to the public, and it was called Lilyweight and the term weight will later be adopted as the universal term. Lilyweight was originally created for a guild called Trouble Brewing for a way to determine between players. It started off with just slayer and skill average, but more aspects of the game will be taken into account later. In the earlier stages of Lilyweight, it will take into account your skill average, slayers, minion, net worth, and collections. Then it will give you a number and categorize you into different stages of the game accordingly. And the bot was pretty popular upon release, and it was used by the likes of Linman, Thoughts, I go by lots of names, and more. There will be many more changes to Lilyweight in the following weeks, like nerfing Slayer XP and buffing other aspects. But not long after, another weight system was released to the public. The weight system I'm talking about is Senator Weight. Senator is a well known bot developer in the community that made Hypixel Skyblock Assistant. He mostly made the weight system for fun, and he wanted a tool for players to track progression. And at the time, Lily's weight system was private, so he created his own public one. The main difference between the two is that Senator's weight system was purely calculated off of the player's skill XP and slayer XP, instead of Lily's more complex weight system. And in the following weeks, Catacombs XP was taken into account by both weight systems. All of this was before Catacombs Floor 6's release, so Catacombs were taken very lightly by everyone. I was one of the highest Catacombs levels at the time, and Catacombs gave me a fraction of what skill weight did. Compared to the current version of Lily weight, Catacombs gives so much more weight since players are actually grinding dungeon, and dungeons became a huge part of progression. And as time passes by, more and more people are catching onto the weight systems. Top Skyblock guilds like Lost in Space, Flexing Chimps swap from a skill average Slayer Catacombs requirement to a weight based system since it better represents progression. Even though the weight system is pretty good for showing progression, there's still flaws to the system, and people will always find ways to abuse it. During the Technoblade Mayor, we got a lot of overpowered buffs to our Skyblock profiles, like unlimited speed, faster minion output, and most importantly, 50% more skill experience. I wonder how you can abuse that, right? <laughs> With a 50% more skill experience, you have the ability to spawn a Revenant Tier 5 by just killing one Revenant Tier 5. People abuse the system, gaining millions of Slayer XP per hour, and as a result, gaining insane amounts of weight. Lilyweight tried counteracting this by changing the curve, but the Slayer weight is still very overpowered with Senator weight. Another example would be the double XP week. Hypixel was getting attacked, and players were rewarded with double XP when the server got back online. And with double XP, you can do a lot of things. 
like XP running dungeons, farming, but most importantly, doing alchemy. With alchemy, you just have to spend coins to get skill XP, and a lot of people are very rich. We spent around 20 million coins for around 50 million alchemy XP during the double XP week. People abused this by brewing enchanted sugarcane and having insane amounts of overflow alchemy XP, gaining a lot of weight in the process. To counteract this, both weight systems changed how overflow weight was calculated, but overflow XP is still very good with Senator's weight system. And as sites like Skycrypt add a weight feature, the weight system becomes much more mainstream and not limited to the endgame players. Even YouTubers like 30virus talked about the weight system in the community tab, making the weight system more and more mainstream. What do you think of the weight system? Do you think it's good where it is right now, or do you think it needs some changing? Let me know in the comments down below, and have a good one. Peace out.